Hello and welcome to the devotion for Monday, May 23rd, entitled, Obey, But Don't Imitate. Now this whole week, we're going to be looking at what Jesus really did in his interaction with the religious leaders of his day. And the very first thing in his sharing about, with his disciples, sharing about how to relate, he gives this powerful statement. He says, The teachers of the law and the Pharisees sit in the seat of Moses. So you must care, be careful to do everything that they tell you, but do not do what they do, because they do not practice what they preach. Now, I pray that I will never have people making that statement about my life. They have authority. They have a position. Therefore, because you have integrity, you will honor them because of their position. But do not be like them. For someone to say, you will honor Pastor John because he holds the position of pastor, but do not live your life anything like he lives his, would be, in my estimation, the worst critique on my life that anyone could ever make. Jesus makes this statement and follows it up. They tie up heavy, cumbersome loads and put it on people's shoulders, but they themselves are not willing to lift even a finger to help them. Everything they do is to be seen by others. And he talks about how they uh, pray on street corners and do this. He goes, they love to be called rabbi. And then he finishes and says, because every person that exalts himself will be humbled. But if we humble ourselves, we will be exalted. Now, Jesus is looking at the religious leaders of his day. Now, you may not be a religious leader, but you're a part of the community. The second that you take on the character of Christ and become a Christian, people are looking at your life. The big question for today is very simple. Do people say don't practice what they, they don't practice what they preach? Do people look at your life and go, Show them respect and honor because of their position or their title or because of their uh, status, but do not live your life like them. Let's pray. Father, as we start this journey of learning from a negative example, Father, we have people in positions of authority that Jesus is saying, do not live your life like them. Father, I know as a parent, I don't ever want to say, do as I say, not as I do. As a pastor, I don't want to say the same thing. As just a man of integrity, a person who claims to be your follower. Father, I ask that you would open our eyes as we go through this week to any place where we need to have a character change, where we need to modify how we live, how we interact, what we say. Father, let our lives be under the microscope this week as we learn from a negative example. Begin now, Lord, by opening our understanding as we truly try to look honestly at our own life. Are there inconsistencies that we need to shape up? Lord, through your Holy Spirit, show us. In Jesus' name, amen. I would encourage you to be reflective. Take a moment and just sit back and really think, where are the areas that someone could say in my life, respect them because of their position or because of their authority, but don't live like them. And I'll see you tomorrow.